Good morning. It's way too early. It's seven o'clock right now. And I just put my washing into the washing machine. Um, yeah, way too early. Oh God. Um, look, I can't even think. Oh. Yeah, so the, my clothes are in the washing machine. For I have now like 40 minutes. Um, during this time, I think I'm just scrolling around a little bit on Instagram. Then I need to put some things in the dryer and get the other things. It really sucks if you live on the fourth floor. Which means that's like fifth, five floors down. Uh, yeah, so. In 40 minutes I need to get my things. And I guess after that I'm probably getting breakfast. And when my washing is completely done. I start with doing things for my assignment. I was thinking today, first I was planning on going to the university and work in the library. But later I'm meeting up with Jacob and we're going to a museum. So I was like, if I'm going to the university first, I have to bring my laptop and all that stuff and take it around with me the whole day so i'm not i'm still not really decided because i'm way more productive when i'm in the university but then i have to take with me all my stuff so many problems so i will see what will happen but now 40 minutes of just relaxing this time i had clearly too many clothes it's like ridiculous but I'm finished with that now I'm waiting for my stuff in the dryer to get ready so I can get that outside it's still dark dark but it's so pretty mm, yeah so I think I have half an hour before my stuff in the dryer is ready so probably I will get some tea and some breakfast because I'm hungry. It's now nine o'clock. I'm sitting on my desk with my cozy blanket. Outside it started snowing again, which is so nice. Um, yeah, and I'm now finished with my laundry, which means I can start actually working. Ugh. Which I'm not excited about, but it's okay. I can do it. I'm having now some breakfast, so that's the Baumkuchen or tree cake. Because you can see there are very small layers of cake that looks like a tree. And then I have also my tea. And I'm going to work a little bit. Right now they're starting to install some security doors in the, I think, I think on the second floor. Uh, I'm going to get insane here. It's so loud. Aha. Aha. It's now 10 o'clock. They're still hammering and... Oh, I have like three more hours of that before I'm leaving. Don't know if I can handle that. It's so loud in here. Oh, it's now 11 o'clock and I'm still working. But it's just unbearable. Ugh. They are really loud. I hope it doesn't take too long for them because I think they need to change the most doors in this building. Which could take some time because there are four floors and on each floor there are like between 15 and 20 flats and I guess they all need to have their doors changed. And then the next building is attached to ours so 
I hope I don't hear when they are doing their doors. <sighs> Do you hear that? Do you hear that? Ah, I need to get out of here. One and a half more hours, then I'm getting out of here. It's now 12 o'clock, which means I have an hour before I need to leave um, to meet up with Jacob. I'm eating a little bit of the leftovers from the tortellini. I think the workers are on their break right now. I can't hear anything. <laughs> it's a little bit annoying. I worked for a little bit, so I got some things done, which is good. And now, yeah, I'm eating because I'm hungry. And then I see you when I leave. I'm ready now. I had a real problem finding something to wear. Because almost my whole um, wardrobe um, is wet because I just washed them. And a few things that are still in my wardrobe I don't want to wear now because I need them the next two weeks when my parents are here. And I'm not at home so I need to pack for two weeks so I need to not wear certain stuff. Which is just sucks. So I found this, which I think I won't wear the next two weeks, or I'm pretty sure I won't wear it because I'm going to wear it today and tomorrow because, because I need to save stuff. I, I'm not even sure if I have enough clothes for two weeks here. We will see. Maybe I need to wash. I, we will see. But yeah, um, it's now one o'clock. I'm meeting with Jacob in half an hour. And then I think we're going to some kind of museum. And there is a gingerbread house exhibi exhibition, something like that. I think it was a contest. And the pictures online seem very cool. So we are going there. And then maybe a coffee afterwards. I don't know, but I will take you with me. finished with the museum it was pretty cool especially the 
gingerbread house thing was so good. So now we're, I don't know what we're doing. We're both super hungry, so maybe get some coffee. I don't know yet. It's now half past four and I'm finally back home again. I'm so hungry, so I'm probably going to eat something. Because looking at all this, these gingerbread houses made me so hungry. Mm, I'm still debating if I'm going to gymnastics later or not. Because for once, all my gymnastics stuff is wet. I don't have any sport clothes I could wear. Which is a huge problem if you're going to do some sport. So that's the first problem. The next thing is that all the coaches that usually do the practice aren't there today. So there are different ones and I don't know if I want to do that. Because they probably... The, pro uh, the practice is probably not as good as usually. And... I have a lot of things I need to do. So I'm probably staying home and just trying to edit as much videos as I can, sorting all my pictures and videos, stuff like that. Because I'm not going to have a lot of time for that the next two weeks when my parents are here. So I probably should do as much as possible today because tomorrow I need to pack. Um, and write on my assignments but mostly packing and yeah then it's Friday and then my family comes so I'm probably I'm still debating but I think I'm not going today it really sucks because now two weeks without but yeah as I said the first problem is I don't have clothes I don't have pants and I may be having one top, but I'm not sure. But definitely no pants. Which is kind of a problem when you're doing sport and don't have sport pants. Yeah. So this week was terrible with doing sports then. But the next two weeks will also be terrible because there will be no sport probably. And then I'm doing full back in it again because that's not okay. I'm way too lazy right now. But now first eating something and then I still can figure that out. So I'm now having some more tortellini because I'm super hungry. And then I have a tea and some uh, cinnamon bun. So yeah, I'm going to have that. And while I eat, I will watch some videos and afterwards probably start working. It's now half past five, which means I'll probably start working on my assignment for, I guess, maybe another hour. And then I'm doing all the stuff with my um, pictures and videos and yeah, to get as much done as possible. I'm... Um, and probably editing some video, uh, pictures from today and posting them and all that stuff. I'm now getting really excited about Christmas and about my parents or my family come in two days. And I'm so excited. I really miss them. Even though it, it's way easier because I have Jacob here. So it's like kind of having family here. Someone just like someone to cuddle you. I remember... When I lived in Passau, when I didn't have a boyfriend and I weren't at my family, there's no one you can just get a hug from. A genuine hug. Yeah, I remember that. That's really, it's so much nicer to just cuddle with someone, feel like they care about you. It makes it so much easier. But I really miss my family. I... I miss them so much, so I'm, I'm so excited to see them, and have like two weeks, I have one week with my brother and two week, weeks with my parents, I'm so excited for that, I'm a little bit sad because that means I have less time with Jacob, and 
after these two weeks he starts working again so then we can't see each other as often as we do right now but I hope even though my parents are here I get to see him quite a lot but yeah so I'm so excited I was so glad that it was uh, t uh, quiet now I have some neighbor that apparently thinks it's now time to make some disco it's like what the heck why do you need to have your music on so loud there are people who want to work I hate those people so why do you not need to annoy other ones it's now nine o'clock and I have my dinner so usual salad and two sweet breads and I was just really confused right now uh, one of my corridor mates a uh, guy from Sweden just made himself a frozen pizza took it out of the oven and put on a lot of mustard on it which really confused me I've never seen a person eat pizza with mustard but I guess it's a thing I don't know about that but yep and yep today there's probably not a lot of things happening I'm editing videos editing pictures sorting pictures organizing pictures that's probably all that's going to happen so I will see you tomorrow good night good morning guys it's now Thursday which means tomorrow my parents come but now it's still dark um, I'm so excited for tomorrow right now it's half past eight and I needed to get out of my room because they started again their hammering and it's so annoying and it's so loud and screwing and ah yeah, so I'm on my way to the university to work a little bit in the library and yeah, I need to get some kind of breakfast at the university probably a smoothie or something like that I can take with me into the library yeah, but probably I'll be there at around 9 then I think I have until around 12 so it should be quite uh, a productive day. Uh, it's a little bit too warm, so the snow is melting, which sucks. So everything gets just mushy. Ugh. So far we still have a little bit of snow, but I don't think that will last us until Christmas, which really sucks. Because it looked so good. But yeah, I still hope for snow. But now my hands are freezing, so see you when I'm inside the library. I'm now finished at the university. I'm pretty much finished with one of my assignments. I just need to prove it once or twice, but pretty much finished. It's kind of snowing, kind of raining, a mixture in between. I hope it's snow. I'm not totally sure. Um, it's now 12 o'clock, so I'm on my way uh, into the city to meet up with Jacob. And then we're going, I think, to an Indian place. I think it's snow. It's 
still, it's not that warm and cold, so I don't know. So, it's so cold. There is the Christmas tree there. Christmas tree. Sisla, Take some of this. On my way home. It's now almost 3 o'clock and I'm back home again and I'm terribly cold. It's freezing cold in here, I don't know why. The heaters are a little bit warm but not really. So I'm just freezing in here. Oh god. Oh. <sighs> Got up way too early so I'm a little bit tired but mostly just terribly cold so hopefully i get warm again even in the bathroom the heater is not really warm which isn't good because i have to shower later and if it's cold i don't want to do that yeah so that's going to be a problem right now as you see i'm back in bed because i need to warm up because i'm cold so trying to get warm again and then um i need to yeah i need to fold my laundry and probably i think i will put out all the stuff or a few things i'm going to pack and then packing i'm doing tomorrow i think because i'm meeting i think around noon with jacob again because he helps me to get my um, back into the city, into our flat, because it's probably going to be heavy. And I have a good boyfriend, so he helps me with that. Um, yeah, so that means I have before noon, I have the whole morning to pack. So I don't need to do that. But today I probably need to edit some more videos. And schedule them. That's the plan. But now first getting warm. And that takes a lot of energy. So trying to get warm and watch some YouTube. It's now 5 o'clock. And I pretty much did nothing the last two hours. Just watched a few videos wrote with my boyfriend about tomorrow stuff like that so now i think i will get together a few things i need to pack as i said i'm not really going to pack today i think but i'm going to pack oh god my hair is like oh bad um yeah i don't think i'm going to pack today but i will lay out all the stuff i'm Needing to pack and then I pack tomorrow. I think that sounds like a good plan. But it's way too cozy and warm in here. Don't want to get up. Ooh. It's now half an hour later and my room is a mess. Because a few things weren't dry yet so I had to hang them up again. That is everything oh i wanted to show you today what i'm getting my boyfriend for christmas oh i need to do that but yeah just a mess i put out like my camera a few um swedish books a few games stuff like that clothes i need to do tomorrow because as i said there's a lot of things that still need to dry my hair is so dry. What's happening? Is it because it's so cold outside? It's just it's completely dry. I don't understand that. 
now I think I will start probably editing videos. Yeah, trying to get as much as possible done. It's now quarter to seven and I made myself some salad. I washed all the um, plates and stuff I had in my room. So that's washed, I made some salad. I'm going to eat that, now I have no... Mm, that was the last food I had in my uh, fridge. So nothing that could get bad, which is good. Mm, yeah, so we'll eat that and afterwards I'm going to shower and wash my hair and all that stuff. It's now seven o'clock and I probably will end this video here because I'm going to shower, wash my hair, um, and then also edit some videos. Try to not go to bed too late so I can get up early tomorrow and pack. Um, something else I need to do? I don't think so. I will show you Jacob's presents tomorrow because then I have to unpack them so I will show them to you then. Uh, I'm so excited for tomorrow to see my parents. I think I'm more excited for tomorrow than for Christmas. Which is unheard because I'm like the biggest... I'm so excited for Christmas and I love Christmas but I think I'm a little bit more excited for tomorrow. Which is good. I'm so... Oh, I just want to see them. I'm going to see them for two weeks. Which is... I'm so glad they are coming. Like half of or probably almost all of my corridor mates are already home. Just like they're all already seeing their families. I want to see them too. But tomorrow I will. So tomorrow I'm getting up somewhat early, pack all my stuff, and then Jacob will come and he will help me um, get my bag into the other flat. We have an Airbnb flat in the in city center. So he's helping me with that and I think then we're going to eat some lunch, something like that. It's the plan. I'm so excited. So, for you it will be in a second, for me it will be a few hours. Oh. So I see you tomorrow. Good night. Good morning. Today is Friday. Yoohoo! Today I'm going to see my boyfriend and my family. That's the perfect, the best thing ever. Just can't get better than that. Oh, now I'm cold. <sighs> it's so cold in my room. <sighs> Way too cold. It's now 8 o'clock. I just got up. <sighs> it's still completely dark outside. Huh, this weather here. But, yep. Yeah. I now need to seriously pack because my room is a disaster. So, yeah. Packing, 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 getting ready. Hopefully be packed in like an hour. That would be good because then I still have a little bit of time to clean up my room. Which I think I need to do, but we will see. But it's so cold in here. Ooh. Oh god, I'm tired. Yeah, I'm going to slowly start to pack now. So, these are all the things I think I'm going to take with me. Plus all the stuff that's on the floor here. And I have the feeling that might be a little bit too much for my bag. Please not. But it's like... We will see. It looks like a lot and the bag isn't that big, so we will see how that goes. 
I'm not sure. I can't really see it, but it's so beautiful outside. But I thought I would show you now what I got for my boyfriend for Christmas. Oh my. So first, oh, I need to save all the receipts if something isn't right. So I have, he gets two different presents and I think each present has like three parts. But it's, um, one is for his home and it's more or less for both of us. So that's a bigger blanket for his, um, for his couch. Because he has a very small one and we are always, it's, it's not enough. So that's a bigger one. You already saw that. And the vegan or vegetari vegetarian vegan cookbook he's getting. And then I have three little picture frames and my mom, um, my mom got the pictures. So she printed the pictures back home. He's bringing me the pictures so he gets two, three, two or three picture frames, I'm not sure yet, with pictures of both of us and of me. So that's the first. It's half for both of us, it's half for him, so. And then the second present is his main present. It's, uh, oh, first a card. I have a cute little card for you. Star Wars present. That's a, a Christmas sweatshirt. It's a Darth Vader with a Santa hat and it says find a lack of cheer disturbing because we were in a shop and he was like he wants that so I was like it's good you get that. Then I think I showed you that already. I like my coffee to be uh, I like my coffee on the dark side, just a coaster. And then, because he always drinks his water with ice cubes, so I got him this ice cube mold, and those are also Darth Vader's. So that's his real present, and the first things are his somewhat real present. Yes. That's that. I hope he likes the stuff. I have to see how I can get all these things into my bag. Probably first I should get ready so I could pack all the stuff. I absolutely hate packing. From I hate, hate, hate it. My boyfriend always says I'm saying hate too much. I should say dislike. But packaging it's a hate. A deep, deep hate. Uh, packing, not packaging. Oh, it's too early. Can't even think right. Okay, so getting ready, then trying to fit all of that into my bag. I'm now pretty much done packing. It didn't really fit into one bag, so I have one bag in a small bag with all the electronics and then another bag for my camera and another bag for my computer. Bags, 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 but now I think I have everything. I don't know. It's now quarter past nine, so it took around an hour. And now I can eat breakfast, so I'm going to make myself some tea because my throat hurts a little bit. And I think I still have some yogurt. Half past nine and I have some tea and some yogurt with a little bit of granola. And we are back at the hammering. I'm so glad I'm getting out of here. Gets a little bit annoying. There is just hammering and screwing the whole day. <sighs> no, I'm finished with my breakfast. Now my throat really hurts. I don't know what's wrong with that. Mm. So I don't feel the best, but it's going to be okay. And yeah, I'm going to clean my room, so 
clean the bathroom. Then I don't know when Jacob comes. Maybe I have to write him. But I guess the earliest in two hours probably. It's now almost 11 o'clock and I'm pretty much done with packing. Um, I also cleaned my room and I cleaned the bathroom. Um, my boyfriend comes in two hours to help me get the stuff into the other flat. Which I'm really, really glad he's doing that because it's a lot of stuff for two weeks. Um, yeah. Yeah. So now two hours. I should edit some videos, but I'm, I can't. I'm so excited that I'm, I can't concentrate right now. So we're not doing that, which means two hours of just relaxing. I, later I need to clean two bowls. Or the, the dishes from this morning, but not right now. Um, I'm so excited. I'm now on my way to bring uh, my package to the post office. Um, the one which I need to return. It's snowing! It's so great. Um, yeah, and then Jacob is on his way. So we meet afterwards for white Christmas. And now we're waiting for Jacob. And then we move my stuff into the city. almost five o'clock and I said goodbye to Jacob hopefully we see each other tomorrow because he is supposed to meet my family tomorrow and now my the rest of the family already or my family is already on the plane I think they should now flying for like half an hour 45 minutes so I'm going back to the flat maybe I can show it to you and then have Probably one or two hours before I need to get them from the uh, train station. Yeah, because they're coming to the train station and I then get them at the train station. So that's the plan. And I'm back at the Airbnb we're staying at, so I'm going to give you a little tour. So if you come in, that's your view. So. That's the entrance. To the side is a little mirror. To the side is just a huge closet where you can put stuff. And then to this side, there's the first room. It's going to be my parents' room. It, so if you come in, you can see it's the bed. Over the bed are some pictures. There's a huge window, one closet, this thing, and another closet, mirror. So if we're standing in this corner, we can see the bed, the pictures, and there it gets us out again into the entryway. So through the entryway, we're coming into the kitchen. So. Here's the kitchen, quite huge, the floor was pretty amazing, it's like this old wooden floor, so kitchen and then the first room from the kitchen, as you can see on my stuff, is my room, so I have this cute bed with a little desk, so very cute bed, so 
Just like in the window. Where maybe you can see outside. You can. Window. And that's the room from here. Really cute, really cute. Then we come back out into the kitchen. That's especially cool. That's the spice rack. It's like the floor isn't like that gets a little bit up and a bit down. It's really cool. So at the end of the kitchen, there's the last room. That's my brother's room. So it has a bed up there. Underneath is the couch, the desk. Again, with a window, if we stand in the corner, you can see it from the other perspective. Go out here again. So here's the kitchen from here. We go into the bathroom. It has these great flooring tiles. Then it's just a very cool tub. But other than that, nothing really special. Just the bathroom. And then if we go at the end of the kitchen, it's the living room and the uh, eating, dining. So this is the dining table. Here we have the sofa. A cool old chair, there's the kitchen, and then here's the console, the TV, yeah, and that's the whole thing, so if we go into this corner, that's the view from here, and you have three huge windows with a view outside, which is pretty cool if you ask me. So that's the little thing. Oh yeah, she left us a little chocolate, which is cute. So we're here for a week, because in a week we're heading to another place and then my brother will leave, so we're only three heading to the other place, but it's pretty cute here. And I guess for a week that's totally fine. So yeah, I have now, as I said, maybe one or two hours I need to catch them at the train station. So today is the 21st of December, which means today is the shortest day of the year. Which, yeah, it probably felt like that. It was so dark the whole day. But the sun went up at around 9 and got back down at three yeah that's right just like crazy like six hours of sun six hours of sunshine that's that's not a lot yeah but it also means from now on the days get longer again in half a year we have the longest day wet only gets dark for a short amount of time so that's exciting i guess we're all looking forward to that still have around 40 minutes before my parents land or before my family lands and then they need to get into the city which takes them probably another hour <sighs> i don't know what to do i'm so excited it's now almost five o'clock, I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Look what I just figured out. It's so cute. Yeah, but I'm right now on my way um, out again because, as I said, it takes like 40 more minutes before the rest of my family lands. And that's just way too long to just sit here and so I'm heading outside again, and I'm trying to find a... Oh, 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 that's better. I'm trying to find a puzzle. When I was out earlier with Jacob, I don't know if you saw, 
but we were searching some presents for his father and we were in a bookstore and they had a puzzle that seems pretty cool or it seems like a puzzle my mom and me likes so I'm going there right now so we have a puzzle we don't need to search for one yeah. and I actually get out of here again so I probably will see you when I'm back look how cool they just have a park here in the middle of the city an ice field where kids are playing ice hockey that's so neat my parents are now finally on their way into the city it's now seven o'clock I'm so excited. I'm going to see them in like 20 minutes. <gasps> yes! That's so good. So I need to get ready and then head out there so I'm not too late to see them. And they should be here in two minutes. Because they're coming with the Alanda Express. And I think the next one is here in two minutes. I'm so excited! I'm now laying in bed, as you can see because it's now already 12 o'clock or oh, almost 12 o'clock and yep yeah, i'm back in my room the rest of my family is going to sleep in a little bit because they are so tired they all had to wake up very early today so they could every day uh, they could work and finish everything before actually heading to the airport and we when they came we went here they got all the stuff here then we went to eat some fast food at max because they have gluten-free burgers here my mom and my brother can't eat gluten so yeah they did that my brother said it was really good so that was all right and then we just went back here and talked a little bit what we were going to do the next day so tomorrow we are saying or we said we we're going to and first go a little bit of shopping because my parents don't really have presents for us. I think the problem is we didn't really have wishes. So they wanted to go shopping tomorrow to buy us a little bit. So we actually get stuff for Christmas. Um, and then we're going to the old town, so Gamlastan. And going there to the Christmas market and meeting up with my boyfriend. So he is going to meet my family and yep, that's that. So yep, that's it for today. I don't know how much I will film the next few weeks or the next two weeks, the next few days. I try to film at least a little bit, but I don't know how much I actually can film. So if there's not as much, just know. I'm spending time with my family. I haven't seen them now for three months. Almost four months. Almost four months. Yeah, that's a lot of time. So I'm just enjoying the time with them. And yeah, be grateful that they're here. And I will see you maybe tomorrow. We will see. Goodbye.